So now we got the final update on Microsoft Teams apps, which means that we can actually join Zoom rooms directly from a native Teams rooms on Android. So let me show how it actually looks on this side. I have my Teams rooms on Android. So you can basically see the big screen, which is the front of room screen. On the table, I have my console. And if I drag that one a bit closer, you can see it's basically the same as the Teams meetings. You have one touch to join. So basically, you can walk up to the meeting room and hit the Join button, and then you would be connected to Zoom, even though it's a native Teams room. So what it actually does is that it basically opens a browser using the WebRTC protocol, which means that it could join directly into Zoom, and then you have the Zoom experience directly on your native Teams rooms. So now you can basically walk into the room, send the invite, even though it's a Zoom call, send it to the Teams rooms, you can easily join that. You would, of course, still be able to join your native Teams rooms that is, as it is. So this is just an add-on. So if you want to improve the quality, and the usage of the meetings, then you would be able to join your teams, sorry, both your Teams meetings and your Zoom meetings directly from the native Teams rooms. So let me show how it is done. First of all, we need to make sure that everything is updated uh, correctly in the Teams Admin Center, which means that I go directly to Teams rooms on Android, I would take my meeting room, which is basically right here. I go into the health, and here I can see now mine is already updated, but this is where you want to update your uh, Teams rooms on Android. Next thing, then you would need to make sure that the console is also updated because it's, it's on the console where you're doing the setting where you allow uh, your native Teams rooms to do a Zoom call as well. So in here, uh, you went to the touch console, go to the meeting room, and down here again, you would need to update the Teams app to uh, use the, the app version called 102. So now we updated it from the Teams Admin Center. Let us go back to the TC8 panel. So basically what you need to do is go into the more settings, the settings, and here you go to device settings. When you are in device settings, go to the admin setting and type in your admin and your password. And then go into Teams admin settings and under meetings, you would be able to now tick off the Zoom meeting buttons. So if you wanna add that one, and if basically if you wanna join with a custom nail email, you can then enter that. I basically just want to join with my meeting room so they can see it's a meeting room joining. But after these settings, then you would be able to, or all the user would be able to walk up to the native Teams rooms on Android and still be able to, of course, join your Teams meeting, but also join your uh, Zoom meetings right away. So right now, there is a few limitations that you need to be aware of. So for instance, if you're doing a dual screen setup, it will only be one screen that actually joins the call. If it is a, a single screen, then of course it's the single screen that joins. Another limitation is the HDMI ingest. If you're using that on a normal basis on the Teams meetings, then it will not work on the Zoom meetings. In that case, you would need to go to share.zoom.us and share your content from there or from your Zoom uh, desktop app application if you want to do that instead. But a really nice feature that is uh, finally here on the Android-based systems. So now you're able to join your Zoom meetings directly from native Teams rooms. Thank you so much for joining. Let's see you out there. Bye.